It's time for Game Changers, presented by Visa. Anyone can change the game. This is the part of the show where we talk about sleepers, those guys that maybe aren't started in a ton of leagues but could provide some dividends for you. So, who is your Week 5 sleeper? Uh, I'm going to go with Mr. George Pickens of the Pittsburgh Steelers here. And uh, last week, I I was just kind of like, I think they're going to give him more playing time. And and it came to fruition, which... Uh, I I love to see, but what I love even more is the change of quarterback because Mitch Trubisky just wasn't throwing downfield enough. He he just wasn't the guy, at least with Kenny Pickett, there'll be ups and downs, but I I think he'll be more aggressive and Pickens was his top target. I know it's a very small sample size of just 13 pass attempts against the Jets last week, but five of them went to George Pickens. I'm not saying he's the new wide receiver one here. I still think that's Deontay Johnson, but I think opposite of him, he could get a lot of work. Picket to Pickens might be becoming a thing there in Pittsburgh. Picket to Pickens in Pittsburgh. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickle peppers. (laughs) My sleeper for week five is Ryan Tannehill. And I've sort of been riding this train. This is, I will admit, a little bit of a personal wish because I have a league where I've been starting Ryan Tannehill after I lost Trey Lance. And the matchups have continued to be good. And Tannehill has taken advantage of them. I don't think you can count on Ryan Tannehill weekly to go out and get you 20 to 25 points. That's just not who he is. But if he can get you in the neighborhood of 18 to 20, you have to feel good about that. And the commanders are a matchup where he can certainly do that. You see, he's a, the Washington team has allowed 10 touchdown passes this season, tied for the most in the NFL. And Tannehill is doing it by spreading the football around. Yes, Robert Woods is getting more involved. Derrick Henry has been very much involved. Guys like Kyle Phillips are involved. Uh, Chigo Okonkwo, I think I said that right, is getting Kudos involved. To you. So they're, <laughs> they're spreading it around. And Ryan Tannehill is taking care of the football. He's not making big mistakes. So certainly a 2QB league. He's very startable. But I think even in 12-team leagues, he has sleeper potential this week. Especially with a whole bunch of quarterbacks that we thought we were going to be able to trust just like not playing well this year. If you have been rolling with Stafford, if you... If you've been rolling with Russ and hopefully didn't start him last night, uh, Ryan Tannehill might be your guy. Just saying.